Hello everyone, and welcome back to Rex TV. Today, we are going to discuss the possibility of Vice President Constantino Chiwenga becoming the next leader of the ZANU-PF party, and what that could mean for Zimbabweans. Firstly, it's important to acknowledge that the current president, Emerson, Dombudzo Nangogwa, has been in power since November 2017, following the resignation of Robert Mugabe. During his time in office, Nangogwa has initiated several economic and political reforms aimed at revitalizing the country's economy and improving the overall living conditions of Zimbabweans. However, there are still many challenges that the country is facing, such as hyperinflation, unemployment, and lack of basic services. Now, if Vice President Constantino Chiwenga is elected as the leader of the ZANU-PF party, there is speculation about what changes he could potentially bring to Zimbabwe. Chiwenga is a prominent figure in Zimbabwean politics, having played a significant role in the removal of Robert Mugabe from power and subsequent developments in the ruling party. It's important to note that Chiwenga has a military background and has been the subject of controversy due to his involvement in the political sphere. Some people argue that his leadership could potentially bring stability and security to the country, while others question his commitment to democratic principles and human rights. In terms of economic policy, Chiwenga's leadership could potentially bring about a different approach to the current economic challenges facing the country. However, it's crucial to carefully consider the potential impact of his policies on the economy, as well as the welfare and rights of Zimbabwean citizens. Ultimately, the prospect of Vice President Constantino Chiwenga becoming the next ZANU-PF leader raises important questions about the future direction of Zimbabwe. It's essential for Zimbabweans to engage in constructive dialogue and debate about the kind of leadership they want to see in their country, and to actively participate in the democratic process, as always. It's important to approach these discussions with respect and consideration for differing viewpoints, and to prioritise the well-being of all Zimbabweans in the pursuit of a better future for the country. Thank you for watching, and feel free to share your thoughts and comments on this topic.